it's Rebecca Louise and Alfie. Alfie, get in your bed. All right, guys, you guys get on your mat. Alfie needs to get in his bed. We are doing an intermediate abs and cardio. It takes grit series. Yes, if you have not already got your copy of my new book, It Takes Grit, what are you doing? You're missing out. You're going to get serious FOMO. There's a full 30 day program in there as well, as well as the whole mindset shift to get you guys to level up your actions. All right, guys, so we're going to get started today. We have got 30 seconds of exercise. We got like an eight second rest in between. It's not a lot, but we are going to do it intermediate today so we're going to take it off with some high knees to begin with so we're going to bring those knees up nice and high to the chest we're going to take this away in three two one let's go all right so it's just 30 seconds of each exercise we are going to get through this whole series together nobody is going to be left behind so each week it's going to get slightly more challenging oh and guess what all you got to do is show up and give it your best just give it a go because those results those abs yes they are going to come you're going to get them this summer this winter whenever you start this program but remember 80 percent is nutrition so if you're doing these workouts and you're not adding in the burn program meal plan well you're not going to get results bring those knees up and release all right we're going to take it into whoo Oh, we're gonna ourselves out. We're going into halfway lift. So you're gonna come all the way down and you're gonna take it into a halfway lift. So it's just up and down. That's it. So breathe in through your nose and exhale out. Oh, all right. We're gonna do so good today. Yes, we are. So halfway and then all the way down. So we've only got eight seconds in between each exercise. So if you feel like, oh my goodness, I can't get into the next one, no problem. This is just designed to push you. So you just get into the next exercise as soon as you can. We're gonna be up and down, three, two, one, and we're gonna come all the way up to standing. Come to the top of your mat, we're gonna take it into a forward lunge, twist, and then come back to the center. Let's go for it. Hardly any rest today because we want to keep the cardio engaged right we want to keep that heart rate up so every single movement is going to have a little bit of cardio in a little bit of abs in because we want to burn as many calories as possible so cardio is going to burn lots of calories during the workout and the strength training those body weight exercises are going to burn calories afterwards take it all the way down twist and give me one more and Release, okay, come down to the ground. Hands at the top of your mat. We're gonna take it into a mountain climber hold. So you're gonna push down, you're gonna hold, three, two, one, and then back out. Now that hold, you're gonna bring the knee to the elbow. Pull those abs nice and tight, and then shoot it all the way back. And let's go for it again. Hold at the top, three, two, one, shoot that leg back. Now lean forward just a little bit. Pull those abs in even tighter. You've got this. You can make this happen for yourself. How strong are you? You are made of a little bit more right now. Give me one more on the other side. Hold for three, two, one, and release. Okay, straight on to your booty. We're gonna take it into Russian twists. So bring your hands together. You're gonna to keep those heels on the ground and you're gonna twist from side to side. Oh yes, that's it. All you gotta do is keep following along. 80% of what you look and feel like is down to nutrition. It's the food that you eat. So if you're not eating the right food, you're not getting a good post recovery shaken after you've done a workout, you are not gonna get results. So you can check out the nutrition plans, all the details in the link below. You can even work with one of my coaches one-on-one -on -one to get amazing results just for you. All right, come over onto your front and we're gonna take it down to a low plank to a high plank. So you're gonna start down on the ground, low plank, and then push up into a high. Hold for a split second and then take it all the way down. Try not to get those hips to move from side to side. Push down into those fingertips, all the way down to the ground. Hold those abs nice and tight and push down. Now try and alternate it. So if you come down with your left, this time come up with your right and then take it over to the other side. A little bit of brain thought as well there. All right, less than 10 seconds to go. Lean forward just a little bit more. Breathe in and exhale. Take it down, last high plank and release. Come all the way up to standing and we're gonna take it into oh, some little squat jumps. Yes, we are. So all we're gonna do is up and down, just like so. If you're not jumping today, all you're gonna do is take it into some nice squat, just like this. All right, we got it. Slowly through. Inhale and exhale. Through the toes and then onto the heels. Oh yes, working so good, everybody. We're gonna fly through these workouts. We're gonna fly through these abs and we're gonna get results together. It takes grit to get results. It takes grit to push ourselves. It takes grit oh, to level up our life. But with these workouts, with the new book, you're gonna be able to do just that. All right, take it all the way down, 
to the ground. We're going to take it into a bird dog. So lift those arms up, opposite, and here we go. All right, how are we feeling everybody? Are we feeling like we just got started? Are we feeling like, boom, this is kicking our butt or kicking our abs? Yes, that is the whole point of it. So extend a little bit further, inhale through your nose, exhale out, give yourself a smile, and let's keep on rocking forward. Nice and strong. Yes, tucking those hips underneath even more. Lift up through your arms. Give me one more. And you're gonna roll all the way up to standing and take it into some skater hops. So, out to the side. Straight into it, everybody. Now you're like, oh my goodness, this transition is so quick. I know, because I wanna give you a powerful 10 minute workout right now that is going to really boost your metabolism, boost the energy, and get you guys going. All right, over to the side. That's it, keep that chest lifted. Push the booty out to the side. A little jump in the middle. Remember, if you don't want to jump today, you can still take it into those curtsy lunges. Three, two, one, and release. All right, back to the center of your mat. Take a nice big breath in. <sighs> Exhale out, and we're going to take it into high knees. Let's go. So bring those knees up nice and high. We're going to take these exercises through one more time. Oh, yes. Yeah. So the first time was just a warm up. Now we've got to retrain our brain to really go for it. Bring those knees up higher. Give yourself a smile. We can do this, everybody. We're having fun. We're working out. Let's go for five, four, three, two, and one. All right, release all the way down. Come down to halfway. So you're gonna bring those heels onto the mat. Take a nice big breath in. Ah, lean back and halfway sit up. That's all you gotta do. Halfway up and then come down. Woohoo! Yes, we're really starting to step it up a little bit. It's gonna get even harder. We've got advanced, we've got an expert, and then we've got the military style. Oh yes, you think you can push yourself? We're gonna keep on going. And that's what progress is all about. Just doing something that's a little bit more difficult outside your comfort zone. All the way down, lift up for three, two, one, and stand back up. I know we're up and down, we're up and down. We're gonna take it into that forward lunge with a twist and take it over to the other side. Nice low twist to get those obliques on fire. And then releasing those shoulders, bring those hands straight in front, or you can bring them on your hips. But when you bring them in front, you're gonna get a bit more of a twisting motion to work those obliques. That's it, halfway there. Come on, you've got this. We're gonna take it down onto the ground next for those Russian twists. Take it across the body, bring those feet back to touch. And three, two, and one. Down to the ground. We're gonna take it into some mountain climbers with the hold. So push down onto your hands, lift up, and let's go. Bring the knee whoo, out to the side, pull those abs in nice and tight, and take it over to the other side. Inhale and exhale. Take it again. That's it, we got this. Extend nice and long. And again, breathe, three, two, one. Take it back over to the other side. You've got this down into those fingertips. Take it over, we've got less than 10 seconds to go here. You can make this happen. Over to the other side for five, four, three, change, two, one, and release down onto your booty, onto these Russian twists. So hands together, lean back, and take it side to side. Okay, take a nice breath here. Yes, lean back a little bit further. Now hit those hands down onto the mat. If you're not touching the mat either side, you're not actually working those abs, those obliques as much as you could. So lean back a little bit further, whew, and really twist those obliques round. We got this, less than 10 seconds to go. Keep moving, just a couple more exercises left. You've got like three to go, and then we are done. And all the way over onto your front, we're gonna go into that high to low plank. So four exercises left to go, basically two minutes of exercise. You got this, let's go for it. All the way down and push up. Hold for a split second, hold each time to make sure that you get that plank nice and still and hard, Ooh, and hold it all the way up to the top, that's it. So you wanna make sure that you're getting that full range of motion. Lift all the way up the top, come down, push into those hands, hand lift up, come on. You've got 10 seconds left to go here. Push all the way up into those hands, hold nice and high, breathe through this, let's go for three, 
two and one all right come back to the middle of your mat and we're going to take it into whoo, those little squat jumps breath in for three two one let's go so small little jumps that's all we're going to do nice bend in the knee lift and down we go we got two exercises after this keep this rhythm just keep going i can do five more five four three two one and another five four three two one and again for five four three two one and release come all the way down to the ground we're going to take it into those bird dogs so two exercises left to go extend those arms up nice and high and let's take it out Whew. now pull those abs in nice and tight tuck the belly in between underneath really pulling the belly button into your spine so you've got no gap from your mat to the mat back to the mat remember extend the arm up lean a little bit more extend those arms further extend those feet a little bit more to the edges of your mat and let's go for it we've got five breathe four and three two give me one more and roll all the way up we're going to go straight into those skater hops so shake it all out last 30 seconds let's go out to the side here we go come on get a little bit higher in that jump feel the body moving feel your body burning up feel your body filled with energy Ooh, with positive feelings we got this halfway there keep on going every single rep counts right now it's the end of the workout let's go for five four three Come on, give me two and one and release. Oh my goodness, you guys did so great. Make sure that you check out my app because that's where you're going to get the meal plans. That's where abs are made. Check out this next workout and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. If you want to really challenge yourself, lift up two, lean back a little bit further and then bring it back up. So if you're right here, just try and lean back just a little bit further as much as you can. That's it. So